got some snowshoes She's got the moody blues They bought dinner for two You're on a surfboard You're on a surfboard You're on a surfboard You know, you look like hell. You always say the sweetest things. <laughs> what, no muffin? You are so welcome. So, what happened after I left Friday night? Did you ask that girl out? Not really. You chicken out. Not really. Not really, not really. What does that mean? I don't know. Well, whatever happened, at least one of us had fun. Laura got so drunk she passed out at a bus stop. <laughs> you think I'd be worried about her, right? But she's actually done that before. <laughs> oh, that's why I love her. I had such a freaking headache the next day. Amen to that, brother. So how's the new place? Oh, it's great. And there's an amazing view too. It's the best thing to wake up to in the morning. That sounds nice. What is it? <laughs> the destruction site. <laughs> God, it's so annoying too. They start work every day at 6 a.m. Who does that? Yeah, but aren't you paying like next to nothing for it? Oh, I am. I mean, the place is dirt cheap and it's actually a really nice oh, yeah. apartment. So then I would be able to deal with it. That's because you sleep like a rock. What? I do not. <laughs> do you remember at Doug's party when you fell asleep on well, the I floor? I was drunk and passed out. There is a big difference. You had three beers. You fell asleep and admit it. I did not. Really? Or maybe I did. I know you did. I mean, come on. We had you hanging upside down. I still can't believe you didn't wake up or use your head as a mop. Yeah, I still don't appreciate that. I had gum stuck in my head for like three <laughs> days. Remember? Oh, this horrible. I shaved my head. Oh, I looked awful. <laughs> something I need to tell you. Well, yeah, I kind of figured that when you said, hey, let's uh, talk over coffee. What? Is it serious? It is. Well, how serious are we talking about here? Like, I crap my pants serious or I missed my period serious? Like, Big Bird got caught tickling Elmo serious. Damn, that's pretty serious. All right, well, Go on, what is it? I know why Laura didn't come home on Friday night. Yeah, me too. No, you don't. Look, she didn't fall asleep at a bus stop. I know. You know. I know. So you know that Laura and I... Yeah, that you guys slept together? She told me. She told you? Yeah, the next day. Then, why have you killed me already? I don't know. 
It doesn't really bother me anymore. You're not mad. Oh, believe me, I was. But I'm over it now. Look, Trent, I am so sorry. I mean, we did not mean for it to happen. Sean, it's, it's okay. We're cool. I don't get it. Why are you not mad? Because I had sex with your mom. Mm -hmm. Alright, obviously you are upset. But look, dude, you don't upset stuff about my mother. You know how I love you. But it's true. It's not funny. It shouldn't be. It's not a joke. Alright, whatever. Get your anger out, make fun of my mom, whatever. Sean, I'm not making fun of your mother. Then quit saying you slept with her, because it's pissing me off. Dude, I'm only saying it because it happened. What the hell are you talking about? After Laura came home and told me what happened between you two, I was absolutely livid. Right? It killed me that my best friend could do something so cruel. So when I was Saturday night and I had a drink, right? I needed to decide whether I could forgive you or not. Well then, it was drowning away my sorrows. I ran into your mother. And she could see how sad I was. But she sat with me and we talked. And, like a bolt of lightning, it hit me. I was gonna get you back in the biggest way possible. I was going to have sex with your mom. And no offense, but after a few beers, it was actually pretty easy. So yes, I slept with your mother on Saturday night. And Sunday morning. After she made me breakfast. <laughs> that's a, that's one hell of a bombshell drop, huh? But if there's any consolation, she was really good. A plus in my book. Hi, sweetie. She must be speaking to you because she was calling me daddy all night. Why is my mother here? Oh, we're going to grab some lunch. What? You know, I've been thinking. You and Laura should keep seeing each other. I mean, I'm tired of her anyway. And besides, I'd rather keep dating your mom. Hmm. How does that sound? What? You know, I better not keep the lady waiting. Hey, but uh, thanks for the coffee. Oh, are we still on for pool this weekend? You know, you could bring Laura. <laughs> I could bring your mom. We can make it a really nice double day. Think about it. I'll give you a call. Mom? Yeah. 